Chapter 31 Dire Beasts You Are Listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 31 Dire Beasts Translator Atlas Studios Editor Atlas Studios More than a dozen trucks came to a halt, and many people jumped out of them, all of them professional martial artists. In the outland, many of the dire beasts were very strange. Most of them were not afraid of firearms. Hitting dire beasts with them wouldn't produce much effect, unless they were especially powerful firearms. This was also why martial artists became the main force for pioneering the outland. Lin Fong and Fong Xiu jumped out as well. They saw a pack of dire beasts in front of them. Some looked like dogs, but they were much larger. Moreover, their entire bodies were grayish dot white. They were densely packed, with about a few hundred of them. Their subspecies wolves, ordinary dire beasts. Feng Xiu had some understanding of dire beasts. In fact, many people recognized that these were the highly common subspecies wolves in the outland. Ordinary subspecies wolves were basically just ordinary dire beasts. Only the stronger ones were comparable to elite dire beasts. However, there weren't many of such subspecies wolves. Most of them were ordinary dire beasts, but there were a large number of them, and they weren't easy to deal with. Disperse. The leader of the guards was Xian. Although this woman seemed very young, she was very experienced and had been enrolled in the Polar Academy before, so she was definitely not weak. Following her command, many martial artists took out their firearms. These firearms were not meant to kill these subspecies wolves, but to frighten and disperse them. Loud noises rang out. The firearms were rather imposing. The subspecies wolves immediately showed a trace of panic, and many of them couldn't help but back away. There was a howl. All of a sudden, the initially somewhat frightened subspecies wolves recovered their order. They glared at the convoy menacingly. Xian's expression changed slightly. She looked at the middle of the subspecies wolves. There was a gigantic wolf that was obviously three times the size of an ordinary subspecies wolf. An alpha wolf. There's actually an alpha wolf in the pack. We're in trouble. Xian looked distressed. The alpha wolf was also known as the wolf king. It was the leader of a pack of wolves. Although the subspecies wolf was equivalent to an ordinary dire beast and did not seem to be very strong, the alpha wolf strength was extremely terrifying, comparable to that of a dire beast lord. Every single dire beast lord was comparable to a peak grade 9 professional martial artist. In a 1.1 dot on point one fight, an ordinary grade 9 professional martial artist was far from being its match. Especially when there were so many ordinary subspecies wolves. If a huge battle really broke out, it would definitely be a hard battle. Even if they won, it would be a Pyrrhic victory. Xian took a deep breath and quickly made a decision. She immediately invited the three strongest grade 9 professional martial artists in the convoy and said to the three of them, the three of you are experienced grade 9 professional martial artists. Can the three of you can deal with the Alpha Wolf L.RG? The three of them pondered for a moment before saying, if the three of us are dealing with the Alpha Wolf alone, it shouldn't be a problem. However, the Alpha Wolf has so many ordinary subspecies wolves protecting it. It'll be very difficult for us to surround and kill it. That's simple. We will attack the subspecies wolves together. The three of you just need to focus on dealing with the Alpha Wolf. If you can really do that, we'll have no problem. The three of them appeared very confident. Although the Alpha Wolf was a dire beast lord, it was not as if the three of them had never killed a dire beast lord by combining their forces before. If you have problems with this website, please continue reading your novel on our new website freewebnovel. Com thanks. Xian immediately made arrangements. She deployed most of the martial artists to form an assault team to escort the three professional grade 9 martial artists to surround and kill the Alpha Wolf. Meanwhile, the remaining people remained behind to protect the convoy. Lin Fong, Fong Xiu, the two of you can stay here and protect the convoy. Please protect Xiao Mo as well. 
she's just a bit straightforward and doesn't have any malicious feelings towards you. Hearing how forefront Xian was, Lin Feng also nodded. This is our responsibility. Since they had accepted the mission, they would definitely protect the people in the convoy. Hmph, Feng Xiao wasn't too willing to protect Xiao Mo. This little brat was simply too vicious with her words. However, with Lin Feng here, it wasn't his place to say anything. On the other hand, Xiao Mo pouted her lips as though she was unwilling to be protected by Lin Feng and Feng Xiao. However, now that Xian had gone to kill the dire beasts, Xian definitely wouldn't be able to keep her in line. Lin Feng did not pay much attention to Xiao Mo. In fact, they were at the back of the crowd. They would not be in any danger before the subspecies wolves charged here. At this moment, Xian had already started organizing martial artists to attack the subspecies wolves. This was also the first time Lin Feng had seen a battle between martial artists and dire beasts. Xian was obviously very experienced in this kind of battle. She had organized 30 professional martial artists, all of whom were at least grade 5 or grade 6 professionals, with most of them even being grade 7 professionals. Three of them were top grade 9 professionals. Furthermore, these martial artists were all wielding steel sabers or particle sabers. Using sabers to fight with dire beasts was indeed a great advantage. Under the Alpha Wolf's command, the subspecies wolves also pounced towards the martial artists in a frenzy. However, these ordinary subspecies wolves were unable to pose any threat to so many martial artists. Thus, the speed at which the martial artists advanced was very fast. In about seven or eight minutes, they had already advanced to a position not far from the Alpha Wolf. Kill it. The three grade nine professional martial artists immediately broke away from the crowd. With a flash, they quickly pounced on the Alpha Wolf. Even though there were countless subspecies wolves that wanted to protect the Alpha Wolves, how could they resist three grade nine professional martial artists? Moreover, there were other martial artists who were constantly cleaning up the subspecies wolves around the Alpha Wolf. The Alpha Wolf did not flee. Instead, it howled towards the sky. Then, its body actually enlarged once again. It engaged in battle with the three grade nine professional martial artists. And it was not at all at a disadvantage. Ha, yeah, that's it. Feng Xiu didn't give it much regard. Even though the three professional grade 9 martial artists had rich combat experience, their strength was not much. Feng Xiu was confident that he could take on two of them alone. After all, Feng Xiu was a genius student of the Myriad Academy, and one could practice all kinds of profound martial arts in Myriad Academy. The martial artists outside the academy weren't so lucky. Xiao Mo was slightly incensed. She clenched her fists tightly and said, Humph. If you're so good, then go ahead. Sister Xian and the others will definitely be able to kill the Alpha Wolf and chase away these subspecies wolves. They're not like rich young heirs from the Myriad Academy such as you people, who only know how to fool around. You've never even seen such ferocious dire beasts before, right? Feng Xiu's face darkened. No matter how much he didn't want to lower himself to the level of a little girl, he was still fuming. As a peak grade 9 professional martial artist and a genius student of the Myriad Academy, he was valued everywhere he went. Yet, in this insignificant convoy, he was being derided by a little girl. Feng Xiu was just about to lose it. Thus, Feng Xiu sneered, Great, why don't we see if your sister Xian can repel these dire beasts then? The two of them were both fuming. Lin Feng ignored them. He could sense that there was a strange change in the wolf pack, and even a dangerous aura. Something isn't right. What is it? Lin Feng abruptly raised his head. His gaze incomparably solemn. Be careful, there's another alpha wolf. Lin Feng could not help but shout. Chapter 32 Killed with a single punch you are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 32 Killed with a single punch translator Atlas Studios Editor 
Atlas Studios, what, another Alpha Wolf. Everyone was stunned. How could there possibly be two Alpha Wolves in a single pack? Whoosh! The Alpha Wolf that Lin Fong had noticed leaped into the air, and its body began to expand rapidly. In the blink of an eye, it had become four or five times larger than an ordinary subspecies wolf. How could this be an ordinary subspecies wolf? This was clearly a alpha wolf. Even though Lin Feng's warning was very timely, the reaction of the three grade nine professional martial artists was still slightly slower. Moreover, this huge alpha wolf was very cunning. It attacked immediately at lightning speed. Bang! Two grade 9 professional martial artists joined forces and threw a punch at the Alpha Wolf which had launched the sneak attack. However, the Alpha Wolf was unexpectedly strong. With a jolt, the two grade 9 professional martial artists felt their entire bodies go numb and couldn't help but take a few steps back. Even their arms felt weak and sore. With just one blow, they had actually already lost. Retreat the three of them did not dare to clash head dot on. These were two alpha wolves. They immediately gave up on killing the previous alpha wolf and returned among the martial artists. The thirty professional martial artists led by Xian were now in a dilemma. Two out of the three professional martial artists suffered light injuries, and the two alpha wolves were watching them menacingly. There was a howl. The alpha wolf howled towards the sky. At the same time, all the subspecies wolves howled and approached the martial artist step by step. Many martial artists became nervous. This was an extremely dangerous situation. The alpha wolf wasn't dead, and they had been surrounded instead. How can there be two alpha wolves in a wolf pack? That largest alpha wolf in particular has probably far surpassed the average dire beast lord. We're in trouble now. Although these martial artists were experienced, they were helpless in such a situation. At this moment, Xian's expression was also grim. She enunciated, there isn't two alpha wolves. There is only one alpha wolf, and it is the largest dire beast that ambushed the three grade nine professional martial artists in the end. That is the real alpha wolf. It is really too cunning. First, it used a subspecies wolf that wasn't inferior to dire beast lords to attract our attention. Then, it waited for an opportunity to launch a sneak attack. It was obviously trying to get us all in one fell swoop. This alpha wolf is extremely intelligent. We are in danger. Xian could not help but glance at Lin Feng, who had warned her just now. However, Lin Feng was only a grade 7 professional martial artist. What use could he be? Now, even three grade 9 professional martial artists couldn't stop it. The real Alpha Wolf, in particular, did not seem to be an ordinary dire beast lord, but a peak.level dire beast lord. Never mind the fact that two of the three professional grade 9 martial artists were injured, even if all three of them were unharmed, they might not be able to gain the upper hand against this terrifying alpha wolf. As the wolf pack advanced step by step, everyone held their breaths and focused. Those who were still guarding the rear had their hearts in their throats. If you have problems with this website, please continue reading your novel on our new website freewebnovel.com thanks. Even Xiao Mo knew that the situation was not looking good. Feng Xiu glanced over at Xiao Mo, then back at the wolf pack, especially that ridiculously massive alpha wolf. He chuckled lightly, it's just an alpha wolf. Why are they so nervous? Xiao Mo couldn't help but exclaim, you, you guys are too despicable. Can't you see how Sister Xian is in danger right now? They're fighting with their lives on the line in front, yet you're mocking them at the back. Was that mocking? That's the truth. A mere alpha wolf is nothing. If you are so good, go up there and kill the alpha wolf. Why should I go up? Didn't Sister Xian give us the order? We just need to guard at the back. You, Xiao Mo's face was flushed red with anger, but she was unable to say anything. She looked as though she was about to cry, 
and tears welled up in her eyes. After all, she was just a little girl. Fong Xiu, guard the rear. Brother Fong, you don't have to save them so early. They look like they can still hold out for a while. Since we've accepted the mission, we have to contribute. Seeing the relaxed expressions on Feng Xiao and Lin Feng's faces, Xiao Emo opened her mouth, but refrained from saying anything in the end. Are these rich heirs from the Myriad Academy trying to get themselves killed? Xiao Emo muttered under her breath. Her voice was very soft and Feng Xiao did not hear her. Lin Feng heard her, but he did not care in the least. Bang! Lin Feng stomped on the ground, and it seemed as if the entire ground was shaking. Immediately after, a huge pit appeared on the ground, and he instantly leaped into the middle of the pack of wolves like a cannonball. Was that? That seemed to be the two students from the Myriad Academy. Rich heirs from the Myriad Academy. All of them are useless. Is he trying to get himself killed? The power of that strike just now was very strong. It couldn't be simple. We may really have another source of help. Seeing Lin Feng charge directly towards the pack of wolves without even a battle saber, many people were very surprised, but what they mainly felt was disdain. There were geniuses in the Myriad Academy, but most of them were just some profligate heirs who relied on piling resources to become professional martial artists. How could they possibly be of any use? Xian and the rest naturally saw Lin Feng as well. However, they were struggling to even protect themselves at the moment, and naturally could not protect Lin Feng. Boom! Bio Lin Feng jumped into the pack of wolves at once. He threw a punch, and a terrifying force exploded. The surrounding subspecies wolves were killed by Lin Feng's punch almost before they could even approach him. Moreover, Lin Feng advanced step by step towards the alpha wolf with great determination. One after another, the subspecies wolves pounced towards him, but it was to no avail. Lin Feng was like a god of war, invincible among the wolves. This, grade 9 professional. He must be a peak grade 9 professional. Impressive, impressive. He must be a genius from the Myriad Academy. To think that the caravan had managed to invite such a genius. If I had known earlier, I wouldn't have worried. Although there are many profligate heirs in the Myriad Academy, true geniuses there are also very terrifying. This person's strength far surpasses ordinary grade 9 professional martial artists. There's hope for us now. Seeing Lin Feng's prowess, anyone could tell that Lin Feng had the strength of a grade 9 professional. At this moment, Xiao Mo's mouth was agape as well. There was a look of disbelief on her face. Seeing this, Feng Xiao's spirits lifted. He laughed heartily, little girl, now you know how formidable we are, don't you? Xiao Mo pouted and said, he's the one who's powerful, not you. Besides, no matter how powerful he is, can he defeat that alpha wolf? Of course brother Feng is powerful. As for me, although I'm not that powerful, I'm still much stronger than those nobodies you folks invited. Alpha Wolf Heh, Brother Fong doesn't even need to use a second punch to kill an Alpha Wolf. Big talk. Xiaomo naturally did not believe it. One look at the Alpha Wolf's stature and one could tell that it was no ordinary beast. Even a truly formidable grade 9 professional martial artist would not dare to claim that they could defeat the Alpha Wolf with a single punch. But what would Xiao Mo know about how terrifying the top 100 students of the Myriad Academy were? At this moment, Lin Feng had already charged all the way before the Alpha Wolf. Moreover, there were two that were comparable to dire beast lords. Oh Wu. The Alpha Wolf seemed to be able to sense Lin Feng's threat. Hence, it growled and stared intently at Lin Feng. Swoosh! The Alpha Wolf moved, and two dire beast lords pounced at Lin Feng together. Be careful! Xian could not help but remind him loudly. She even felt somewhat resentful in her heart. Even if Lin Feng was strong, he shouldn't have been careless. He should have converged with them and killed the Alpha Wolf together. 
wild bovines tread. Lin foamed through a punch. It was like a wild bovine galloping through the wilderness, carrying five tons of force as it enveloped the two dire beast lords. Bang! Lin Fong sent the massive bodies of the two dire beast lords flying back with just one punch, and they fell heavily to the ground. The alpha wolf howled in pain for a few times, then stopped moving. It was obviously dead. Lin Fong retracted his fist, looking nonchalant. I'll leave the rest to you. With that, Lin Fong returned to the crowd behind him. Chapter 33 Dragon Mountain Base You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 33 Dragon Mountain Base Translator Atlas Studios Editor Atlas Studios subspecies wolves were social dire beasts. When they discovered that the alpha wolf had died, they would quickly leave. Many subspecies wolves quickly retreated. In the blink of an eye, only a great number of subspecies wolves' corpses were left behind. The air was still filled with the thick smell of blood. When many people looked at Lin Fong again, their gazes were now filled with shock and reverence. No matter who it was, in the outland, powerful martial artists were naturally respected. A strange light flashed across Xian's eyes. She was once a student of the Polar Academy, and she knew very well what it meant that Lin Fong was able to kill the Alpha Wolf with one punch. Such strength was definitely top dot tier even in the Myriad Academy. There was even a chance that he could break through the genetic lock and become inhuman. Perhaps, Lin Fang's trip to the Outland this time was to break through the genetic lock through life dot or dot death trials. However, she didn't quite understand why Lin Fong would accept such a mission with so little reward. Regardless of the reason Lin Fong joined the team, Xian would still express her gratitude. Without Lin Fong, they would be in trouble this time. Thus, Xian walked up and expressed her gratitude to Lin Fong. Thank you for your help. Since I accepted the mission, I should take action. There's no need to thank me. Beside him, Xiao Mo's face was flushed red with embarrassment. She saw clearly that Lin Fong had indeed saved everyone this time. Feng Xiao sneered, with Brother Feng helping, everything will be resolved. Don't worry, with Brother Feng around, as long as we don't encounter any dire beast kings, there won't be any trouble. Humph, talking big again. Xiao Mo simply didn't get along with Feng Xiao. Even though she knew that Lin Feng's abilities were formidable, she still felt that Feng Xiao was exaggerating things. The strength of the subspecies wolves wasn't great. Even dire beast lords differed in strength. There were some ferocious dire beast lords that even ten or so peak professional grade nine martial artists wouldn't be able to defeat. As for the dire beast kings, they were basically calamities. Once they appeared, the entire convoy would be annihilated. Talking big. Brother Fong is one of the top 100 students of our Myriad Academy's virtual battle chamber. Feng Xiao's face was filled with reverence. Although he had been defeated by Lin Feng and was even somewhat discontent, ever since Lin Feng had entered the top 100 of the virtual battle chamber, he had thoroughly accepted his defeat. Otherwise, he wouldn't have been so willing to follow Lin Feng to the outland. Virtual battle chamber. What's that? Xiao Amo cocked her head to the side with a puzzled look on her face. On the other hand, Xian's expression changed slightly. As a former student of the Polar Academy, she naturally knew what the virtual battle chamber was. This was something found in all three top-notch martial academies, and she was well aware of what being the top 100 entailed. It's our honor that the two of you can accept this mission. As long as you can escort us safely to the Dragon Mountain base, we are willing to give you 10 more points each. If you have problems with this website, Please continue reading your novel on our new website freewebnovel.com thanks. 10 points would be 10 million, and for two people, it would be 20 million. This was not a small number, especially for a small trading company. This trip to the outland would make at most 100 or 200 million in profits. Moreover, the remuneration for the various professional martial artists who were invited must be excluded. 
In actuality, there wouldn't be much left after. Sister Xian. Xiao Mo was a bit anxious, but Xian waved her hand and stopped her from speaking. Lin Feng glanced at Xian. He wouldn't actually reject her offer, so he nodded and said, All right. Heh, little girl, it's your gain even if you add 20 million more, Feng Xiao said while laughing. With Lin Feng's assurance, Xian finally heaved a sigh of relief. Even though she had an additional 20 million, it was worth it, especially since they had already encountered a herd of dire beasts. With Lin Feng, a top 100 student of the Myriad Academy, there was no doubt that their safety was a major guarantee. The rest of the journey was much smoother. Even though the convoy would occasionally encounter some dire beasts, they could easily deal with the beasts just by relying on the other professional martial artists in the convoy. There wasn't actually the need for Lin Feng to act. Finally, ten days later, the convoy arrived at Dragon Mountain Base. Dragon Mountain Base was huge and lively. It was one of the many bases in the Outland, and it was considered a relatively safe one. Hence, business here was booming, too. Freelance martial artists or adventuring martial artists would come to explore the Outland, and bases were where they recuperated and resupplied. When Lin Fong and the others walked into the Dragon Mountain base, such was the scene they saw. People were busy everywhere. Sometimes, someone would be carrying a dire beast that looked like a small mountain, looking excited. At this time, many people would be envious. These were all freelance martial artists. If they could kill a dire beast lord, they would be able to sell it for at least 10 million, or even more. Thus, professional martial artists, especially those who roamed the outland, were mostly rather wealthy. They could obtain large amounts of money just by hunting dire beasts. Money could also bring resources and increase their strength, forming a positive cycle. However, there were far too few high dot level martial artists that could hunt dire beast lords alone. Moreover, they would often encounter dangers in the outland. They might even be devoured by dire beasts the next day. After the trading company was escorted to the designated location, Xian started to settle the remuneration. Some martial artists would continue to escort the trading company back to Delta, while some martial artists would stay at Dragon Mountain Base to hunt dire beasts and earn money. Lin Feng and Feng Xiu were both remunerated. With three points and the additional 10 million yuan, which would be 10 points, Lin Feng earned 13 points from this trip alone. Actually, this was not bad at all. It was equivalent to killing a dire beast lord. Moreover, that was not all. As Lin Feng killed two alpha wolves, both of which were dire beast lords, the caravan also brought the corpses to the base. They sold for 23 million in total. Lin Feng earned 60% himself and the remaining 40% was given to the caravan. Thus, this amounted to about 13.38 million. Xian topped up 200,000 to make a total of 14 million, or about 14 points. In other words, Lin Feng had obtained 27 points in just one escort mission, which was close to 30 million. The other martial artists in the convoy were all incredibly envious. They could earn at most a few million in a single trip, and it would be at the risk of their lives. However, although they were envious of Lin Feng, they also knew that top-dot-tier martial artists like Lin Feng could earn money very quickly in the Outland. Every top-dot-tier martial artist in the Outland was well dot off. Lin Feng was very satisfied with earning 27 points as well. All right, we have to report to the base of the Myriad Academy now. I hope that we can work together again in the future. Xian smiled and said, I can't afford to hire a top-dot-notch martial artist like you. See you in the future. After bidding farewell to Xian, Lin Feng and Feng Xiu headed to the base of the Myriad Academy. As she watched the two of them leave, Xiao Mo muttered, Sister Xian, if not for that incident, you'd have stayed in the Polar Academy and certainly wouldn't be any worse off than that guy. Xian shook her head and heaved a long sigh, Xiao Mo, you don't understand. Even if I'm still in the Polar Academy, I'm still far from Lin Feng's level. 
If he doesn't die, perhaps in a few years' time, the Dragon Mountain base will see another powerful inhuman expert. Sister Xian, you believe that he can break the genetic lock? Xiao Mo's eyes widened in disbelief. Chapter 34 The base you are listening at novel full dot audio. Chapter 34 The Base Translator Atlas Studios Editor Atlas Studios The base of Myriad Academy was huge and fairly easy to find. Lin Feng and Feng Xiu soon found the base. There were many people coming and going in the base, and it seemed to be rather lively. However, most of them were staff members, and students from Myriad Academy were fewer. As Lin Feng and Feng Xiu were about to enter the base, someone stopped them. This is the base of the Myriad Academy. Outsiders are not allowed to enter. We are students of Myriad Academy, and we applied to come to the Outland. Oh, someone applied to come to the Outland again. Show me your identity cards. The person who intercepted Lin Feng and Feng Xiu was a tall lady. After looking at their identity cards, she led them into the base. Feng Xiu could not help but ask, why can't I see many students from the Myriad Academy? I remember that there has been over a hundred students from the Myriad Academy who applied to come to the Outland over time. The young lady glanced at Lin Feng and Feng Xiu, shook her head, and said, you guys have come at a bad time. It's quite dangerous to apply to come to the Outland at this time. The reason why you can't see many students from the Myriad Academy is because they have all gone to participate in the war. War. War in the Outland. Feng Xiu's expression changed. He seemed to have thought of something. That's right. Recently, Dragon Mountain Base is engaged in a large dot-scale war with the Dire Beasts. Moreover, it's a decisive battle. Once we succeed, Dragon Mountain Base will be able to expand forward by thousands of kilometers. The three mines, two plateaus, and a forest included will all become human territory. The young woman had a smile on her face as she said this. Brother Feng, looks like we really came at the wrong time, Feng Xiu smiled wanly. Perhaps he was worried that Lin Feng did not understand, so he explained things in detail once more. The human territory only took up about 10% of the whole world. The remaining 90% were all outland occupied by dire beasts. Over the past few centuries, as experts emerged among the humans, the human race also began to expand their territory. The advancement of one base after another was like a bridgehead, slowly advancing and devouring the territories in the outland to fight for the space to survival for mankind. On the whole, the dire beasts seemed to be very powerful. They occupied 90% of the land, and their numbers were also greater than humans. However, the dire beasts did not have a strong ruler, and they mainly moved in hordes. Dot thus, human martial artists could divide and conquer them gathering strength to defeat one dire beast horde after another, and then obtain large amounts of resources and land. The reason why Dragon Mountain Base was called Dragon Mountain was that it had a radius of a thousand kilometers, and from an aerial perspective, it looked like a huge dragon. The purpose of Dragon Mountain Base was to seize this stretch of land. From the looks of it, the Dragon Mountain Base had already begun the final battle with the dire beasts. Once the final battle began, on the surface, it could bring about maximum interests, but in reality, many martial artists would die in the final battle. Even inhuman experts who had broken the genetic lock might perish. The social status of martial artists might be very high, but it was also obtained through one bloody battle after another in the Outland. If you have problems with this website, please continue reading your novel on our new website freewebnovel.com thanks. The young lady brought the two of them to register before asking, do the two of you want to be freelance martial artists, or hunting martial artists of our Myriad Academy? What's the difference between the two? Of course there's a difference. Hunting martial artists can obtain the Myriad Academy's overdraft quota. Normally, the overdraft quota is 100 points. Moreover, the Academy's items can be bought at a 20% discount. Also, Hunting members can get merit points. 
Once their merit points reach a certain level, or even when they purchase the Academy's items internally, they can receive further discounts. However, there are advantages and disadvantages. Students have to contribute 30% of the resources obtained through hunting. As for freelance artists, they aren't absolutely free either. They still have to obey the Academy's arrangements. However, they have no overdraft quota, and won't get any discounts when purchasing items within the Academy. Moreover, they only have to contribute 20% of the resources obtained through hunting. Lin Fong and Fong Xiu looked at each other. Although there was only a difference of 10% in the amount of contribution, and it seemed like it was very big, one must keep in mind the discount when purchasing things internally. In fact, there would even be more discounts in the future. Furthermore, the Myriad Academy would more or less provide extra benefits for hunting martial artists. Let's be hunting martial artists. Lin Fong made the decision. Smart choice. In fact, more than 90% of the students from the Myriad Academy who reach the Outland will choose to become hunting martial artists. A smile appeared on the young woman's face. She quickly helped the two of them apply for their hunting martial artist identity cards. All right, from now on, the two of you will be the hunting martial artists of the Dragon Mountain base of Myriad Academy. You must keep your identity cards with you at all times. This is the proof of your accomplishments in the Dragon Mountain base when you are carrying out missions or clearing up dire beasts. With it, no matter how many dire beasts you kill, it will be fully recorded, and they will be converted into points and merit points. Afterward, the lady led Lin Fong and Fong Xiu before a map. She pointed at the map and said, This is the map of the entire 1000.km range of Dragon Mountain. Only dire beasts killed within this range will be converted into points. Otherwise, you can only sell the corpses of the dire beasts to the merchants. In this area, an ordinary dire beast can only be counted as 0.1 point. In other words, you have to kill 10 ordinary dire beasts to accumulate 1 point. Killing an elite dire beast is 1 point, and killing a dire beast lord is 10 points. Lin Fong raised his brows and asked indifferently, what about dire beast kings? Dire beast kings. The lady smiled faintly and continued, although there are also dire beast kings in this area, there are very few of them. Moreover, dire beast kings are practically invincible at the level of professional martial artists. If you guys are unlucky enough to encounter a dire beast king, then I only have one suggestion, and that is to run as far as possible. Are there no points for killing a dire beast king? Lin Fong still wanted to get to the bottom of the matter. Of course there are points. If you really kill a dire beast king, you can get 100 points. The young lady only felt that Lin Fong was overly ambitious. However, considering that Myriad Academy students who could apply to come to the Outland were basically the best of Myriad Academy, it was normal for them to be confident. However, once they had experienced hardships in the Outland for a period of time, they would realize how terrifying those dire beasts were. Forget about dire beast kings, even dire beast lords would be enough to give those genius students of Myriad Academy a headache. By the way, can we go to the front line now? The front line. I don't recommend you to go to the front line. You can sweep the area not far from the base. There must be a lot of dire beasts that were missed. Killing them will still earn you points. Understood. By the way, you have a communication device in your identity card. If you encounter any danger, you can call for help. If you receive any distress messages, try your best to rescue the sender. Most importantly, during the war, the commanding officer of Dragon Mountain Base can conscript you. The front line is currently in the midst of a war, and there has yet to be a second conscription. Once you receive the conscription message, you must head to the conscription location immediately. Otherwise, you will receive severe penalties. Lin Fong and Fong Xiu both nodded. Although this young lady was a little long-winded, she had at least allowed the two of them understand the situation at the Dragon Mountain base. The two of them returned to the dorms provided by the base to plan things out properly first. 
Chapter 35 Proboscis Beast You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 35 Proboscis Beast Translator Atlas Studios Editor Atlas Studios' Lin Fong and Fong Xiu had just arrived at the Dragon Mountain base. They did not know anything about the situation, and wouldn't possibly charge out to fight the dire beasts at a whim just after hearing the young lady's words. That would be foolish behavior. In the dormitory, the two of them went online to find out about the situation in the Dragon Mountain base. After arriving at the Dragon Mountain base, the two of them entered Dragon Mountain's network. After inputting their identity cards, they successfully entered the network. On the network, the two of them saw a striking leaderboard at first glance. It was the merit rankings. To a certain degree, the merit rankings were actually equal to the points rankings. If one killed an ordinary dire beast, they would obtain 0.1 merit points, and an elite dire beast was worth 1 merit point. As for a dire beast lord, that was worth 10 merit points. It was almost the same as obtaining points, but there were also some differences. That was, if an inhuman expert who broke the genetic lock wanted to kill a dire beast king or multiple dire beast kings, they might sometimes recruit some people to surround and attack it. Then, the assister would also receive a certain amount of merit points. As for the use of merit points, it was very simple. There would be a discount when purchasing the various resources within the Myriad Academy. Those with higher merit points would even enjoy various privileges within the Dragon Mountain base. In short, merit points were a good thing. Furthermore, only when one's merit points reached 10,000 would they have the qualifications to receive a discount. Moreover, the discount was 20%. If their merit points reached 100,000, the discount would be 40%. If their merit points could reach 1 million, then the discount would increase directly to 80%. But it was nearly impossible to reach a million merit points. This was because these merit points were only targeted at the level of professional martial artists. Once one broke through the genetic lock and became an inhuman expert, that would be other rules. If one below the level of an inhuman wanted to obtain a million merit points, one would have to be a terrifyingly bloodthirsty killer. They would likely have to slaughter all the dire beasts in the entire Dragon Mountain region. Lin Fong glanced over. Right now, the person ranked first on the merit rankings only had 130,000 merit points. Moreover, there were only three people ranked above 100,000. The rest were all below 100,000. Feng Xiu was already dumbstruck as he muttered in a low voice, 80% off, that's 80% off. Lin Feng rolled his eyes and said, take a closer look at the merit points you need. 1 million merit points. You'll have to slaughter all the dire beasts in the entire Dragon Mountain base. Forget about 1 million merit points, even 10,000 merit points would be quite difficult. Indeed, 10,000 merit points was nearly equivalent to killing a thousand dire beast lords. That sounded difficult enough, let alone 100,000 merit points. Of course, there were a lot of dire beasts in the base. Dire beasts would even constantly pour in from the outside, and it was almost impossible to kill them all. Thus, there was no need to worry about not being able to find any dire beasts to kill. Brother Fong, let's start sweeping. I can't wait to start. Originally, Feng Xiu was a little afraid of coming to the Outland. However, when he saw that there were so many rewards in the Outland, he was also a little tempted. With so many rewards and with the accumulation of resources, he believed that as long as he could stay alive, his strength would definitely improve by leaps and bounds. If you have problems with this website, please continue reading your novel on our new website Freewob Novel. Calm thanks. This was also why so many geniuses were willing to come to the Outland. Lin Fong had come to the Outland for one purpose, and that was to break the genetic lock. However, he had collected a lot of information online regarding breaking the genetic lock. He had even spent points to listen to the lectures of inhuman experts, but there was no fixed method to break the genetic lock. Breaking the genetic lock even varied from person to person. 
There was no guarantee of breaking the genetic lock by practicing certain martial arts or having a certain amount of resources. Otherwise, the human race would have long been flooded with inhuman experts. It would not be like the present, where inhuman experts were relatively rare. However, there was a consensus. Breaking the genetic lock required the extreme pressure of life or death situations. Only under great pressure could one break the genetic lock and become inhuman. All right, let's go sweeping now. Lin Fong nodded in agreement. Then, they left the Dragon Mountain base and headed out. Outside the base was the wilderness. There was neither forest nor lush grassland, only some broken rocks. The site was extremely desolate. The ground was filled with pits and ravines. It was obvious that an intense battle had taken place. There were basically no dire beasts so close to the base. This place had long been swept by the martial artists over and over again. It would only be possible for them to encounter dire beasts near the front line if they kept going forward. Thought the two of them ran along the way for two hours. Finally, they saw a dozen or so proboscis beasts ahead. Proboscis beasts were one of the most abundant dire beasts in Dragon Mountain Base. They were slightly stronger than the subspecies wolves. In a 1.1 dot on point one battle, ordinary subspecies wolves were no match for ordinary proboscis beasts. Proboscis beasts were enormous. Their biggest characteristic was their strong defense. They had tough skin and flesh, and were very strong. However, their movements were a bit slow, and they were not very agile. Typically, a grade 5 professional was needed to deal with a proboscis beast 1. On point 1. In addition, there were many proboscis beasts, so they were indeed somewhat difficult to deal with. Even an ordinary professional grade 9 martial artist wouldn't dare to go up against a dozen or so proboscis beasts so casually. If they got careless, they might even be killed by the proboscis beasts instead. However, Lin Feng and Feng Xiu were different. Both of them were top dot tier professional grade 9 martial artists, especially Lin Feng, who could not be considered a typical top dot tier professional grade 9 martial artist. Wonderful, Brother Feng. Let's see who can kill more. Feng Xiu appeared very excited, and also somewhat eager to give it a try. Although his strength was not on par with Lin Feng's, he still wanted to compete with Lin Feng in certain aspects. All right, let's do it. As soon as Lin Feng finished speaking, he charged toward the proboscis beasts like a bolt of lightning. Feng Xiu was not to be outdone. The two of them charged into the proboscis beast horde one after the other. These proboscis beasts were also very hot. Tempered. Seeing that the two tiny creatures dared to charge in, they roared at the sky and slammed their huge trunks forward. Swoosh. The proboscis beast's trunk was very strong, but Lin Feng reached out and grabbed it directly. Hiya. Lin Feng swung with all his might. He grabbed the huge proboscis beast by the nose and smashed it onto the ground. Then, he drew his particle saber. Swish. The proboscis beast's head was split into two with a swing of his blade. Lightning Arc Saber Technique In terms of killing, a battle saber was naturally superior to fists, especially when Lin Feng was using the lightning arc blade, which was known for its speed. Originally, his lightning arc saber technique had only reached entry level and couldn't even be considered adept. However, with Lin Feng's powerful strength, it could unleash unparalleled power. This was especially true after he had mastered the basics of the lightning arc saber technique. He would have to constantly utilize it and rely on constant killing to improve his saber technique. Swish. 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 Streaks of lightning flashed, followed by splashes of blood. Wherever Lin Feng's particle saber passed by, not a single proboscis beast could defend itself effectively. In only a minute, Lin Feng had killed more than ten proboscis beasts, while Feng Xiu had only slain three of them. The huge difference made Feng Xiu rather disheartened. 
There were a total of thirteen proboscis beasts, and Lin Fong had taken care of ten by himself. That was one point, which was also equal to one merit point. To Lin Fong, burning points and merit points was this simple. Forget it, I won't compete with you anymore. Brother Fong, so you've also practiced the lightning arc saber technique. That is a killing saber technique. I can't beat that. Feng Xiao was rather dispirited. It was one thing for him to be weaker than Lin Feng, but now, when killing ordinary dire beasts, his speed wasn't comparable to Lin Feng's either. That was demoralizing indeed. There are plenty of dire beasts, enough for the two of us to kill. Lin Feng smiled. He had finally encountered a dire beast and gained something. This was a good omen. Just as the two of them were about to continue searching, they suddenly received a distress call from their communicators. Chapter 36 Distress Call You Are Listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 36 Distress Call Translator Atlas Studios Editor Atlas Studios, SOS We encountered a massive number of proboscis beasts. There are eight proboscis beast lords, over a hundred proboscis beast elites, and innumerable ordinary proboscis beasts. The situation is extremely perilous. Nearby martial artists, especially martial artists with over 10,000 merit points, please come to our rescue quickly. This distress call appeared very abruptly, making both Lin Feng and Feng Xiao slightly stunned. Eight dire beast lords and over a hundred dire beast elites. TSK TSK, he's in big trouble. And what's that about needing over 10,000 merit points? Feng Xiao was a little puzzled. Why would saving lives require higher merit points? Lin Feng thought for a moment and said, perhaps they think that only martial artists with more than 10,000 merit points have enough power to save them. However, this is an opportunity. It's very rare to encounter so many dire beasts. Killing all of them would give a lot of points and merit points. Yes, this was indeed a fortuitous opportunity. Of course, this was only an opportunity for powerful martial artists. For martial artists with insufficient strength, it would be a huge problem. Even rashly going in would be life-threatening. Brother Fong, you want to save them. That's right. Mostly for the points. Feng Xiao naturally had no objections. With Lin Feng around, how could there be any danger? Thus, the two of them quickly rushed over according to the coordinates on the communication device. On a slope, three myriad academy students were trapped on the hill. Brotherly, the distress message has been sent. We can still hold out for another half an hour. But what if no one comes after half an hour? If no one comes in half an hour, we can only break out at all costs. Brotherly also didn't know what to do. The three of them were all grade 9 professional martial artists. They had not been deployed to the front line, and had instead taken advantage of the timing of the front line battle to sweep through the wilderness. They even intentionally released bait to lure many proboscis beasts over. Their plan had succeeded. The proboscis beasts did arrive. Unfortunately, their luck seemed a bit abysmal. There weren't ten or so proboscis beasts, but a massive horde. Thus, they were trapped on the mountain slope, holding out desperately using the terrain of the mountain slope. Just the sight of so many proboscis beasts was enough to make one despair. However, there was nothing they could do now. They could only wait and hope for a miracle. Time passed by slowly. Before they knew it, twenty minutes had passed. The three of them were all injured to varying degrees and could not hold out for much longer. Brotherly, are we going to die? Li shuddered. That's right. They came from the Myriad Academy, and were all the prodigies of the Myriad Academy. They had never thought that they would die one day. Previously, their journey in the Outland had been smooth sailing. In just a year, they had accumulated hundreds, then over a thousand points. If you have problems with this website, please continue reading your novel on our new website freewebnovel.com thanks.
it seemed that they had never encountered any danger before. However, they were in danger now, and it was life-threatening danger. This was the outland, not the virtual battle chamber. They had to face dire beasts, not virtual opponents. Death seemed imminent. The three of them were afraid. They were terrified. They were hoping for a miracle to happen. However, they knew very well that most of the professional martial artists had gone to the front line. Even if there were people at the base, how strong could they be? A few ordinary professional martial artists wouldn't be able to save them. This time, they were indeed in danger. Beep dot beep dot beep, where are you guys? Suddenly, a new message appeared on his communicator. Someone is coming to save us. Brotherly, we're going to be saved. The three of them were overjoyed. They had not expected that there would be a turn for the better when they were on the verge of despair. Hence, the three of them hurriedly sent out another message. We are on a hill not far from the coordinates. By the way, how many of you are there? Two. Brother Lee's expression fell. There were only two people, but could they be experts? Thus, Brother Lee asked again, do the two of you have more than 10,000 merit points? I don't mean to be rude. The situation we're in is very dangerous. If you come here without due consideration, I'm afraid you'll be in danger too. We arrived at the base from the academy today. We don't have any merit points. Brother Lee and the others all fell silent. They had woken up from their ecstasy. These were actually newbies without any merit points. How strong could students who had just come from the Myriad Academy possibly be? Even if both of them were grade 9 professionals and were the cream of the crop in the Myriad Academy, this was the outland. Grade 9 professional martial artists were a dime a dozen. Even veterans like the three of them had to form a team before they dared to go to the outland to combat and kill dire beasts. What could two newcomers do? A wan smile appeared on Brother Lee's pale face. In the end, he replied, thank you for coming to save us despite the danger. However, it's too dangerous here. You can't save us. It's better if you stop now. You don't have to come here. With that said, the three of them looked at each other. Their previous ecstasy had long disappeared without a trace. Brotherly, so what if we die? We were already prepared to die when we came to the outland. That's right. If the three of us die together, at least we fulfilled our initial promise. Ha ha. It's just dying together. Even if we must die, we'll take more dire beasts with us. This also evoked the ferocious side in the three of them. Since they knew that death was certain, what more was there to fear? At this moment, Lin Fong and Fong Xiu, who were rushing over, were rather surprised. The other party's last message was clearly telling them not to go over. The person asking for help is quite interesting. Fong Xiu, hurry up or we'll only be able to collect their corpses. Originally, those dire beasts were what Lin Fong valued the most. After all, those dire beasts meant a great deal of points and merit points. But now, he was more concerned about the situation of the person seeking help. Soon, the two of them saw many proboscis beasts charging up the hill from afar. There were three martial artists that were attacked by the proboscis beasts. They should be the ones who had sent the distress call. All of them are still alive. That's good. Although Lin Fong heaved a sigh of relief, eight dire beasts lords, over a hundred elite dire beasts and innumerable ordinary beasts did not make for a simple lineup. Even three or four ordinary peak grade nine professionals would definitely not dare to attack so many beasts. This was also why Li felt despair when he heard that there were only two people on Lin Feng's end, and that they were newbies who had just arrived in the outland. The trouble they encountered was not something that could be resolved by two newbies. Feng Xiu, go and protect the three of them. I'll scatter these proboscis beasts first, BDNV, Brother Feng, you want to disperse so many dire beasts alone. Even though he knew that Lin Feng was very strong, 
even Feng Xiu felt that it was too insane for Lin Feng to attack so many dire beasts alone. Don't worry, I won't do it if I'm not confident. Lin Feng took a deep breath, gripped his blade, and stepped back. Boom. It was as if the ground was shaking. Lin Feng charged into the horde of beasts like a cannonball. Chapter 37 One Man, One Saber You Are Listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 37 One Man, One Saber Translator Atlas Studios Editor Atlas Studios, Brotherly, Look, Someone Is Coming to Save Us. Could it be the people who wanted to save us from earlier? Didn't I tell them to leave quickly? Brotherly shook his head, his expression becoming even more despairing. These newbies were extremely talented, but unfortunately, their self-confidence was overflowing. They even dared to charge at so many dire beasts. Did they think that these dire beasts were made of paper? Perhaps only the top 100 students would dare to attack these dire beasts alone. Bang! Lin Fong landed among the dire beasts at once. He glanced in the direction of Li and the other two, then flicked his saber lightly. Snip. The saber was very sharp. Coupled with Lin Feng's unparalleled strength, his physical strength alone had reached more than four tons, not to mention the addition of the sharp particle saber. Hence, everywhere Lin Feng went, be it ordinary dire beasts or elite dire beasts, none of them could block a single strike from Lin Feng. In the blink of an eye, he had already slaughtered his way through the horde of dire beasts. Naturally, this attracted the attention of the dire beast lord. This was especially the case for the three dire beast lords that were leading over ten elite beasts. They surrounded Lin Fong from all directions. This did pose some danger to Lin Fong. After all, he was not an inhuman expert who had broken the genetic lock. He could still get tired and become injured. However, Lin Fong felt excited instead. If he wanted to break the genetic lock, he would have to constantly temper himself in life. or death situations. There was great terror between life and death, but also great opportunity. It had been a long time since Lin Fong had felt such pressure. Even when facing Long Wei Ping, he hadn't felt much pressure. This time, however, facing so many dire beasts, Lin Fong felt immense pressure. Kill. Lin Fong stomped on the ground like a wild bovine and unleashed a devastating aura. At the same time, he wielded his particle saber and transformed into a bloody shadow as he charged forward. The three dire beast lords were already approaching. Lin Fong did not hesitate at all. He had to kill them with a single slash at this moment, and could not afford to be caught up in a tangled fight with them. Spiral Force Double his strength erupted, and more than eight tons of strength was concentrated on the particle saber. Facing the enormous body of a proboscis beast lord, Lin Fong was fearless as he slashed down brazenly. Swish. Lin Feng's terrifying strength, along with the sharp edge of his blade, ruthlessly slashed at the proboscis beast lord's head. Its massive head immediately split into two. Boom. The enormous body of the proboscis beast lord collapsed like a small hill, raising a cloud of dust. If you have problems with this website, please continue reading your novel on our new website freewebnovel.com thanks. It's dead. Did he just kill the proboscis beast lord with one strike? This. This must be the best martial artist in Dragon Mountain Base, one of the top 100 students in the Myriad Academy. Is he really a new bee? At least I've never seen this person before. He's definitely a new face. Brotherly, we're saved. Seeing Lin Feng's ferocious and domineering strike, the three people who were originally in despair once again had their hope reignited. Although this person who came was a newbie, his strength was not inferior to the top 100 students at all. Such an existence was usually ranked in the top 50 or even the top 20 on the merit board. With such an expert around, they might have a chance of surviving with a bit more effort. Hence, the three of them unleashed their potential and immediately began their counterattack. 
At this moment, Feng Xiao also sneaked into the crowd of beasts. Taking advantage of the time when most of the dire beasts were attracted by Lin Feng, he quickly approached the hill and joined the three of them. Are the three of you all right? Feng Xiao saw that the three of them looked rather miserable and were all injured. Li was panting heavily. He had lost count of how many times they had repelled the attacks of the dire beasts. They were indeed exhausted. However, he shook his head and said, We are fine. Thank you for coming to the rescue. We came here because we received your distress call. If you're all right, follow me. We have to help Brother Foam. Are you really newcomers? Of course. We just arrived at Dragon Mountain Base today. Hearing Feng Xiu's reply, the three of them fell silent once again. They found it hard to believe that a martial artist who could kill at Iyer Beast Lord with a single slash had just come to the Outland. That was a proboscis Beast Lord. Its skin was rough, its flesh thick, and its strength was boundless. It was even harder to kill than ordinary dire beast lords. Seemingly noticing their confusion, Feng Xiao said confidently, Although we have just arrived from the Myriad Academy, do you know how powerful Brother Feng is? As a new student, he made it into the top 100 of the virtual battle chamber. So he really is a top 100 student. Li and the others were even more shocked. In reality, they had already guessed some of it. After all, to possess such formidable strength, his ranking in the virtual battle chamber was definitely not low. Even if he wasn't one of the top hundred students, he wasn't far off. But what shocked them even more was that Lin Foam was actually a new student who had only been in Myriad Academy for less than a year. In truth, Lin Feng's situation was even more incredulous than they had imagined. Not only had he not been at the Myriad Academy for a year, he had not even been there for two months. Brother Foam may be strong, but there are so many dire beasts here. We have to take some of the pressure off Brother Foam. I'll deal with one dire beast lord myself, and the three of you will be responsible for stalling two dire beast lords. Is that all right? No problem. There were a total of eight lords amongst the proboscis beasts. Lin Foam had killed one previously, so there were still seven left. Moreover, Lin Feng alone was able to keep two occupied. Feng Xiao could deal with one. Although Li and the other two were injured, it was not a problem to keep two of them occupied. This could also greatly relieve Lin Feng's pressure. Hence, the four of them charged into the horde of dire beasts again and fought alongside Lin Feng. After Lin Feng killed a proboscis beast lord, he did not stop swinging the particle saber in his grip at all, but continued to reap the lives of other proboscis beasts. He was using the lightning arc saber technique. As he killed, he used the lightning arc saber technique again and again, and gained some new understanding of the lightning arc saber technique in the process. As a result, he gradually became more proficient at the lightning arc saber technique. The light of his blade also became faster. After all, the lightning arc saber technique was about winning with absolute speed. Swoosh. 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 Lin Feng had never felt so carefree. He killed one with a single slash, thoroughly angering all the remaining dire beast lords. Hence, a few more dire beast lords charged over. Not only did Lin Feng not retreat, he took the initiative to attack. Kill. Lin Feng's eyes gradually turned red. He had stimulated the ferocity of the wild bovine and unicorn genes within, so he felt no fear at all. Relying on his spiral force and lightning arc saber technique, Lin Feng killed another four dire beast lords and countless elite dire beasts. Five of the dire beast lords had died at his hands, and the remaining three were dealt with by Feng Xiao and the other three people. Lin Feng had fallen into the midst of the beast horde, so he naturally took some hits as well. He had lost count of how many hits his entire body had received. Proboscis beasts were particularly strong, and were not comparable to ordinary dire beasts. However, Lin Feng's extraordinarily strong physique was gradually showing its advantage now. 
Be it restorative ability or endurance, Lin Feng far surpassed ordinary grade 9 professional martial artists. Even those dire beast lords could not compare to Lin Feng's restorative ability and endurance. From a certain perspective, Lin Feng was a terrifying humanoid dire beast that was above most of the dire beast lords. Huh, they retreated. The proboscis beasts retreated. We survived at last. What a, miracle. The few of them fought for a few hours. Finally, after the eighth proboscis beast lord was killed, the beast horde finally began to retreat. Having survived the disaster, Li and the other two lay on the ground, panting heavily and cheering aloud. To them, this was a miracle. However, they also knew who was the person that could turn the situation around and create a miracle. Hence, all three of them looked at Lin Feng simultaneously. Chapter 38 Fusing Proboscis Beast Genes You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 38 Fusing Proboscis Beast Genes Translator Atlas Studios Editor Atlas Studios Lin Feng put away his battle saber, and the madness in his eyes gradually faded. A dense pile of corpses lay beside him, all of which were proboscis beasts' corpses. Although Lin Feng was also very tired, he felt a hint of excitement in the depths of his heart. Perhaps this kind of life was what he actually hoped for. It was a stark contrast to his monotonous life from before. Li and the others walked over and expressed their gratitude to Lin Feng. Thank you, sir. If not for your help, the three of us would be dead today. Li thanked Lin Feng from the bottom of his heart. The three of them had wanted to attract the dire beasts, but they had not expected to cause such a huge trouble. If they had not met Lin Feng, they would really be doomed today. Lin Feng then began to clean up the spoils of war. These dire beasts that were killed on the battlefield would naturally be cleaned up by people from the Myriad Academy. After all, Lin Feng and the rest had already obtained a lot of points. Lin Feng did some calculations. He had killed five dire beast lords, which was about 50 points. Added to that was more than 50 elite dire beasts, which would also be worth over 50 points. As for ordinary dire beasts, they were innumerable. In the end, Lin Feng checked his points and found that he had actually obtained more than 120 points. Added to the previous points, Lin Feng now had 153 points. His merit points were more than 120. This was a huge gain. One had to remember that Lin Feng had just arrived at the Dragon Mountain base for less than a day. Even Feng Xiu benefited from following Lin Feng and obtained some points. The speed of earning money for professional martial artists, especially high-dot-level professional martial artists, was unimaginable. In less than a day, Lin Feng had earned more than 100 million. This was just terrifying. Of course, there were very few professional martial artists who could reach Lin Feng's level. What are your plans? We've suffered heavy losses today, and we're all injured. We're going back to the base to recuperate for a while. Lin Feng nodded and said, that's just as well. We're planning to head back too. Let's go together, Noel Dutton actually, as Lee and the other two were injured, there was risk even if they were just returning to the base. Lin Feng's action could be considered as escorting them safely back to the base. Li was naturally very grateful. Thus, the five of them returned to the base together. After returning to the base, both parties exchanged contact information and then returned to their respective residences to rest. Lin Feng was also tired from the day, but he was very happy to see the 153 points. However, he still felt that he was lacking in the previous battle. Although he seemed very powerful, if he had been alone at the time, he would definitely be dead after being surrounded by the proboscis beasts. He had thought that he was strong enough, but he did not expect the outland to still be so dangerous. Fortunately, Lin Feng had already mastered every inch of his body. At this moment, he could actually continue fusing the genes of dire beasts. Hence, Lin Feng took out a piece of proboscis beast lord's flesh. He was preparing to fuse the proboscis beast's genes. 
the proboscis beast's skin and flesh were tough, and its strength was great. Its genes definitely contained terrifying power, which was suitable for Lin Feng's current direction of fusion. If you have problems with this website, please continue reading your novel on our new website freewebnovel.com thanks. However, the fusion of the proboscis beast was different from the previous two fusions. In fact, neither the wild bovine nor the unicorn could be considered very powerful dire beasts. In fact, dire beast lords could not even be born among them. However, dire beast lords could easily be born in proboscis beasts. This meant that their genes were very powerful. Once they were fused, it was one thing for Lin Feng's strength to increase, but it was another thing for Lin Feng to control such powerful strength. Lin Feng did not hesitate for too long. He checked his various attributes. Physique 19.56 Strength 18.85 Agility 11.34 Technique Basic Fist Technique, proficient, can be improved to adept through continuous practice, wild bovine's might, mastered, comprehended wild bovine's true intent, nonopal body tempering, mastered, can summon a spiral force, lightning arc blade technique, proficient, genetic fusion. Wild bovine genes, 100% fusion, complete fusion, unicorn genes, 100% fusion, complete fusion, genetic capacity. 16% Lin Feng's various attributes were fairly good. He had basically reached the peak of a normal professional martial artist. However, this was far from enough for Lin Feng, who wanted to break the genetic lock. Although there was no direct evidence that the stronger one's body was, the easier it was to break the genetic lock, most inhuman experts who had broken the genetic lock were physically stronger than ordinary professional martial artists. Perhaps there was some inevitable connection between them. Lin Feng was not doing research right now, and he did not have the time to delve into it. He was in the outland, where he could encounter danger at any time. Hence, it was always good to increase his strength and his ability to survive. Hence, Lin Feng immediately ordered the genetic fusion device, fused the proboscis beast genes. Begin fusion. Lin Feng's body shook. A familiar feeling he had not experienced for a long time returned to his body again. This was not the first time Lin Feng had fused genes. He was very familiar with it. However, something was different this time. He felt as if a tyrannical force was forcefully rammed into his body. Buzz. The images of the wild bovine, unicorn, and proboscis beast appeared in Lin Feng's mind. They seemed to be roaring at each other. There was another image of Lin Feng himself. This was Lin Feng's consciousness. Previously, he had already used his consciousness to suppress the instinctive consciousness deep within the wild bovine and unicorn genes. Now that he had fused the proboscis beast genes, the instincts of the three beasts were all activated. However, Lin Feng quickly began to suppress the instincts of the three dire beasts with his own consciousness by using the method in level 1 of nonopal body tempering. As Lin Feng's consciousness was very strong, the instincts of the three dire beasts were quickly suppressed. At the same time, a strong desire seemed to have come up in Lin Feng's body. It was a feeling of hunger. Lin Feng immediately took out the high-dot-grade nutrient solution he had prepared beforehand and injected it into his body. As the nutrient solution was injected, Lin Feng's body seemed to be slowly expanding. In the past, his body looked sturdy, but now his frame was gradually increasing. Even his height had increased slightly. He no longer looked sturdy, but strong. One, two, three. Lin Feng only stopped after injecting eight high-dot-grade nutrient solutions. If it was an ordinary person, even injecting two or three nutrient solutions would probably cause huge issues for their body. But for Lin Feng, this many nutrient solutions could be absorbed by his body very well. Genetic Fusion Complete After the gene fusion process was completed, Lin Feng heaved a long sigh of relief. Power, power invincible power. Right now, his felt refreshed all over. An unprecedentedly powerful feeling filled his heart. 
Chapter 39 Dire Beast Reaper You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 39 Dire Beast Reaper Translator Atlas Studios Editor Atlas Studios after fusing with the proboscis beast's genes, Lin Fong could clearly feel the growing power in his body. It was as if heat was constantly roiling through his body. It was a completely different feeling from the previous two fusions of dire beast genes. This time, it seemed to be much more violent. Hence, Lin Fong started to check the various attributes of his body. Physique 29.86 Strength 26.35 Agility 14.13 Technique Basic Fist Technique, proficient, can be improved to adept through continuous practice, wild bovine smite, mastered, comprehended wild bovine's true intent, non opal body tempering, mastered, can summon a spiral force, lightning arc blade technique, proficient, genetic fusion. Wild bovine genes, 100% fusion, complete fusion, unicorn genes, 100% fusion, complete fusion, proboscis beast genes, 100% fusion, complete fusion, genetic capacity. 48% Lin Feng's physique had improved tremendously, almost by 10%. Among all his attributes, it had increased the most. This was also because of the proboscis beast's unique characteristics. Its skin and flesh were tough, and its defense was astonishing. Ednell.co his strength and agility had both increased by a certain extent, but his genetic capacity had increased to 48%. Lin Fong could not help but frown. This genetic capacity concerned how many more types of dire beast genes he could fuse in the future. It was very important. The previous two times when he had fused wild bovine and unicorn genes, they had only taken up 16% of the genetic capacity in total. Unexpectedly, just the proboscis beast genes alone occupied 32% of the genetic capacity. This also meant that the stronger the dire beast gene that Lin Feng fused, the more genetic capacity it would take up. In fact, in the future, Lin Feng might only be able to fuse one or two more dire beast genes before he must break the genetic lock. In the past, Lin Feng had never thought that the genetic capacity would reach its limit so quickly. But now, it seemed like he was indeed a little too optimistic. Not all dire beasts were like the wild bovine and unicorn genes, which only occupied a little gene capacity. Lin Feng would like to fuse with those dire beast genes that only occupied a small portion of the genetic capacity, but also allowed a decent gain in power. However, Lin Feng had no way of knowing which dire beast genes occupied a small portion of the genetic capacity. He could only try his luck. However, his luck was obviously not very good this time. His physique had increased by so much all of a sudden, and his strength had increased by almost half. Lin Feng was still unable to completely adapt to his strength in the present. He had to spend some time to slowly adapt to his newfound strength. Hence, Lin Feng spent the entire day going to the strength testing room. He began to train his strength, speed, and so on, until he completely adapted to his various attributes. Bang! Lin Feng punched the strength testing device with all his might. The strength testing device displayed over 8,000 kilograms of strength. That was actually 8 tons. Reaching 8 tons of strength by relying on the physical body alone was intimidating to even think about. There was probably no other professional martial artist like Lin Feng, who could reach such a terrifying level purely with his physical strength. Even those powerful dire beast lords did not have such terrifying strength. Lin Feng was now a humanoid monster. If you have problems with this website, please continue reading your novel on our new website freewebnovel.com thanks. Moreover, this was not Lin Feng's limit. He took a deep breath and then unleashed the spiral force. Bang! This time, the numbers for 16,000 kilograms immediately floated out on the strength testing device. That was actually 16 tons. In other words, Lin Feng's level 1 of non-opal body tempering could really double his strength. 
It was not diminished in the slightest due to how formidable Lin Fang's physical strength was. How amazing! This is only the first level of nonupal body tempering. It can only double one's strength. What if it's the second level? Lin Fong was feeling thrilled as well. Initially, he had despaired about the demon king Dong Fang Sheng's ice and fire superpower. It was a talent that no one could match. Even Lin Fong didn't have any hope of winning. However, after he had fused with the third dire beast gene, his strength had advanced by leaps and bounds, and his nonupal body tempering was still effective. He had already begun to form a clear line of thought. Strength was his foundation. He did not have any superpowers, only strength, raw strength. So what if the other party's superpower was strong? If 8 tons of strength was not enough, he'd get 16 tons, if 16 tons of strength was not enough, he'd get 30.2 tons. When one strength reached a certain level, no superpowers or methods would be of any use. That was a true miracle born of great strength. At this moment, Lin Fong became truly determined about the path he was going to take in the future. Since he had an incredible artifact like the genetic fusion device, he must make good use of it and continuously improve his advantage. Right now, what Lin Fong wanted to do was to sweep through the dire beasts and earn points. He needed to earn 1000 points as soon as possible and by the second layer of nonupal body tempering. At that time, he would have mastered the second level of the nonupal body tempering, and even fused the fourth kind of genes. How strong would he be then? Even Lin Foam would not dare to imagine it. So what if it was the Demon King? Lin Foam would still be able to defeat him. Only then would Lin Foam have a greater chance of breaking the genetic lock and becoming inhuman. It was relatively easier to break the genetic lock when various physical attributes reached their limits. This was the common understanding regarding breaking the genetic lock in the current martial arts world. Lin Fong did not know how to break the genetic lock, so there was only one thing he had to do. He must do everything he could to raise his physical fitness to a level that was difficult to attain, or even its limit. Three days later, Lin Fong contacted Fong Xiu again and continued to sweep through the Dragon Mountain area. Yes, sweeping was exactly what Lin Fong meant. If it were in the past, Lin Fong might not have dared to use this term. However, now that he had fused the proboscis beast's genes, his strength had advanced by leaps and bounds. No matter how strong a dire beast lord was, it would not be able to withstand a single blow from him. Perhaps only the legendary Dire Beast Kings could make Lin Fong take them seriously. However, Dire Beast Kings had long disappeared from the Dragon Mountain area. Even if they existed, they'd definitely be on the front line. Hence, there were no Dire Beasts in the Dragon Mountain region that could pose a threat to Lin Fong in the present. So, Lin Fong began sweeping madly. On the first day, Lin Fong obtained 98 points. The next day, Lin Fong obtained 119 points. On the third day, Lin Fong obtained 168 points. On the fourth day, Lin Fong obtained 131 points. On the fifth day, Lin Fong obtained 143 points. More than a month later, the points in Lin Fang's identity card already exceeded 4,000, and his merit points also reached 4,000. This was an insane number. Within a month, the entire Dragon Mountain base knew that there was a maniac like Lin Fong. He swept out the dire beasts in the Dragon Mountain base like a reaper, slaughtering them in a frenzy. However, this was not the end. Lin Fong seemed determined to continue reaping dire beasts to earn enough points. Hence, he did it day after day and month after month. He only took three months to reach over 12,000 points, and his merit points also successfully exceeded 10,000. Only at this point did Lin Fong temporarily stop. With more than 10,000 merit points, he could buy things in the online shop of Myriad Academy at a 20% discount. Thus, it was time to buy the second and third levels of the nonupal body tempering. That's right. Lin Fong wanted to buy the first three levels of the nonupal body tempering directly. 
Chapter 40 Purchasing Two Levels of Martial Arts You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 40 Purchasing Two Levels of Martial Arts Translator Atlas Studios Editor Atlas Studios, look, aren't those the Dire Beast Reapers who appeared at the base lately? Dire Beast Reapers. I've heard of them as well. They always seem to operate in a group of two. The one called Feng Xiao is slightly inferior, but he's also a top-notch grade 9 professional martial artist. The one called Lin Feng is truly terrifying. He's one of the top 100 students in the virtual battle chamber. Top 100. We have quite a few top 100 students at the base too, but they don't appear to be as scary, do they? In the past three months, Lin Feng and Feng Xiao have almost wiped out all the dire beasts in the Dragon Mountain area. This is definitely not something an ordinary top 100 student can do. That's right. Looking at the merit rankings, Lin Feng's merit points have already reached over 12,000. It's only been three months. Humph, so what if he's strong? He's just a coward. He only dares to hide at the back and sneakily sweep through everything. If he is so talented, he should go to the front lines. That's true. Lin Feng is so powerful. Why doesn't he dare to go to the front lines? When Lin Feng and Feng Xiao returned to the base, countless gazes swept over them. They were no longer unknown. They could even be considered famed, and were known as dire beast reapers. Every time they returned to the base, the two of them would receive a lot of attention. Although there were some people who were envious and jealous, Lin Feng and Feng Xiao didn't take them seriously. For Feng Xiao especially, the experience over the past three months was like a fantasy. In only three months, he had actually earned more than 3,000 points. He knew very well that this was all because of Lin Feng. Although most of the dire beasts were killed by Lin Feng, there would always be some who slipped through the net if he followed Lin Feng, and Feng Xiao wouldn't be in danger, so he would naturally be able to obtain many points. With so many points to purchase resources, Feng Xiao could also improve his strength further in a short period of time. Brother Feng, where are we going this afternoon? Feng Xiao had already fallen in love with this feeling of sweeping. It was not challenging or dangerous at all. Moreover, they could earn a lot of points. He couldn't find such a good deal anywhere else. However, this time, Lin Feng shook his head and said, it's already been three months. Let's take a break first and use the points to improve our strength. That's right, improving strength is necessary. I won't disturb Brother Feng then. Feng Xiao quickly bid farewell and left. He also needed to make use of such a great amount of points to improve his strength. Lin Feng did not pay attention to the discussions of the other martial artists at the base. With his vicious reputation as the dire beast reaper, no one dared to make things difficult for him. Hence, he left the hall without hassle and returned to his dormitory. In the dormitory, Lin Feng checked his points immediately. 12,363 points and about the same number of merit points. So I can actually buy the second and third levels of non-upal body tempering. Lin Feng had long coveted the second and third levels of the non-upal body tempering. He realized that the non-upal body tempering was very suitable for him. Even the invincible fist sage, who had created the non-upal body tempering, must not have expected that someone would be able to bring out the full potential of the non-upal body tempering. If Lin Feng could master the second or even third level of non-upal body tempering, he could increase his current strength by three times at most. His punch could even reach a terrifying 32 tons. How terrifying was this? If you have problems with this website, please continue reading your novel on our new website freewebnovel.com thanks. Of course, it didn't mean that the more strength one had, the more powerful one would be. But without a doubt, strength was an important measure of power. No matter what methods one used, one couldn't resist the unparalleled strength from a punch. I've heard that the inhuman experts who broke the genetic lock can easily achieve more than a hundred tons of strength. 
I wonder if I can achieve more than a hundred tons of strength after I fuse genes and with nonopal body tempering. Lin Fong also had a trace of anticipation in his heart. Although he had yet to break the genetic lock, and there were no signs at all, he was gradually learning the details of the inhuman experts who had broken the genetic lock. For example, for legendary inhuman experts who broke the genetic lock, even without using martial arts, they could exert more than a hundred tons of force with their pure physical strength. As for the more powerful inhuman experts, their strength might be even more terrifying. However, none of the inhuman experts who had broken the genetic lock had less than 100 tons of pure physical strength. Pure physical strength was not the foundation of inhuman experts, but it was one of the characteristics of having broken the genetic lock. At least, Lin Fong had never heard of any professional martial artist who could exert 100 tons of strength. Even the Demon King was far from 100 tons in strength. Lin Fong, on the other hand, might very well break through this power limit. Of course, this was only a possibility. Lin Fong still had a long way to go. Hence, Lin Fong immediately logged into the Myriad Academy's online shop and used his identity card to purchase the second and third levels of Nanopal body tempering. Nanopal body tempering required 1,000 points for the second level, 10,000 points for the third level, and 11,000 points for both levels. However, Lin Feng's current merit points exceeded 10,000. He could receive a 20% discount when making purchases in Myriad Academy. Hence, 11,000 points worth of goods could be purchased with 8,800 points. Purchase Lin Fong did not hesitate at all. He bought two levels of Nanopal body tempering directly. The original 12,363 points became 3,563 points. Although points were consumed very quickly, Lin Fong didn't regret it in the slightest. If it could greatly increase his strength, he wouldn't hesitate to buy it even at 100,000 points, let alone 10,000. If points were not converted into power, it would just be a string of numbers. Very soon, Lin Feng's personal inbox showed the mnemonic for two levels of nonopal body tempering. Lin Feng could not wait to start reading it. Of course, the first thing he checked was the second level of nonopal body tempering. The second level of nonopal body tempering was simple and direct. It was to condense two spiral forces. Two simultaneous bursts of spiral forces could increase strength by two times. Nanopal body tempering at the third level was the same. By condensing three spiral forces, three simultaneous bursts of spiral forces could increase strength by three times. Furthermore, if he successfully condensed three spiral forces, he could also mobilize only one or two spiral forces at a time. This was truly miraculous. However, even though the principles were similar, it was extremely difficult to condense two spiral forces. This was because spiral forces were not forces that really existed. They could only be unleashed from the strength of the entire body through a special method for incremental strength. Dot this didn't mean that the spiral force was stored somewhere in the body and mobilized whenever one wanted to use it. It didn't work like that at all. There was no actual force in it, but a type of technique. There was no fundamental difference between the principles of two spiral forces and one spiral force. The principle was to control the entire body, so that one could produce two spiral forces and increase strength by twofold. The difficult part of this was how to condense two spiral forces, and how to increase strength by twofold. If one could only obtain the first level of nonopal body tempering, even if one knew the principle, it would be very difficult to condense two spiral forces. However, this was a supreme martial art created by the Invincible Fist Sage after many years of experimentation. Naturally, it had a well-established system. Hence, Lin Fong found the key to condensing two and three spiral forces in the second and third levels of nonopal body tempering. 